you're enjoying this too much. Ah! What's that burning smell? That's my skin. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Luanne Nikita and welcome to my channel. Today I shall be trying the Smooth Skin Pure, which is this lovely little contraption. It's a at-home IPL system to remove hair. So um, let's have a look. It's a quite a posh box. Ooh. Looks swish. Okay, so, oh Mary, it's not intimidating in the slightest is it? Massive transformer. So Smooth Skin were actually the very first company to actually ever make a at home IPL machine which was about 12 years ago and um, they've done lots of different variants since then. So, and this is their brand new one, the Pure, um, as of the 11th of September 2020. Apparently it's the most powerful that's actually on the market at the moment. So obviously I'm not gonna see results straight away. I will have to do it for quite a long period of time to see results, but obviously at a later date, I'll update you. I think I need a sip of coffee before I commit. Actually, joke. <laughs> right, plugging it in. Don't look at it, Jesus. <laughs> okay, I'm not looking at it. So you can hear it. It's got a cooling system. It's got two modes. So one it is a speedy mode where apparently you can do your whole body in about ten minutes, apparently, and then obviously a delicate mode, which takes a little bit longer. Um, I believe on the speedy mode it's 130 flashes per minute whereas usual IPL machines are sitting around 40 flashes per minute give or take so um, that's actually quite impressive oh, oh I've got a blue light now Woo! oh I don't know if I want to do it oh I'm too scared can I try it on you first? No. Why? I don't want to do it. Why not? It'll be fun. Well, I can't do it. Right, so, pressed it against my leg, and there's some little flashy do frabby thingy and bobs. So, it's now scanning for my skin. I can't do it. I can't yeah. actually press the button. I can press it for you. Legs. Should I try it on a, a thicker piece? Oh. Hang on, move your leg up because you can't. Yeah. I can't do this! I don't want to do this. I don't know how I'm doing this. Whoa! Shh! That's not too bad. Let's move it up. Am I supposed to keep my finger on the button? Ooh! I don't know. <laughs> Am I supposed to just... You're supposed to move it, aren't you? Ooh. Ooh. You're supposed to just hold the thing down, aren't you? Right. Mary! I can get into this. It didn't say anything about eye protection, I don't think. All right, let's scan. I think the biggest problem is I've got Wednesday legs. So trying to get the actual panel flush to my leg is gonna be quite difficult. Um, yeah, joys of skinny little legs. You right there? You're blinding me. Is it really that? It was bright. Is it bright? Oh, it's hot. Oh, knees aren't good. Come on. Oh, 
sugar, honey, iced tea. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh, oh. knees are bad. I can't do the knees. The knees hurt. Oh, I'm gonna try further up the leg. Apparently, you can actually use this on your face, but um. Yeah, I'm stupid, but I'm not that stupid. But I think I might give it a go at some point. Hey, this bit isn't too bad. It's a bit sensitive near that bit. Oh, You're supposed to be able to do this on your bikini line. I don't think I want to try that, but I'm gonna have to, aren't I? Let's see if it works. What do you think? I'll give that a go. Usually what I would do is I have waxes, so I have everywhere wax, pretty much. But um, obviously that's not a permanent thing, it's not a permanent solution. So hopefully, if I'm brave enough to continue, that I can pretty much end up hairless. I'm not a hairy person. Um, the thing about this particular unit is apparently it can work on blonde hair, potentially work, sorry, um, which obviously most IPL machines don't actually work on fair skin, or not, not fair skin, but light hair. So let's continue. Oh, fuck. Oh! oh it's the knees! Oh, shit. Shoot! Oh, I don't like that. I will admit that I am struggling to get the lights to light up on there, so if I turn it, I don't know how I'm going to show this. So you see, like, there's some little lights on there. Can you see it on the camera? Um, obviously, because I'm quite skinny, I'm trying to get it completely flat, like, if it's not flat, it'll go red. But if it's making full contact, then you get the lights, and that is scanning your skin to see how much power is actually needed to uh, effectively zap you with. So. But Wednesday legs. When's they gonna snap? Mm. Oh, it's the knees. I don't like the knees. I don't. I don't even really want to do my shin. I can't do my shin. How do I do it on the shin? Continuing on. See, this isn't too bad. It's not too bad. Oh, that's a bit hotter than on the legs. It's quite burning. I wonder if it work up there. Should I try it? That's your old thing. Shall I give it a go? Shall I Dr. Pepper it? Not too bad. I don't think staring into the flash is a good yeah, idea. But I can't see what I'm doing. I've got to make sure that the dots are working. <laughs> oh no. This is actually quite, it's cool, but the, I think, because I'm doing it on myself, I'm a little bit like jittery, so a little bit skittish. It's like the same as if you try and do your own waxing at home. Oh, that's, that's another story, I'll have to do it at another point. If you do your own waxing at home, it hurts. Yeah, if you go to somebody and they do it for you, it doesn't hurt as bad, if that makes any sense at all. Whereas, I'm pretty sure that this would be exactly the same. If somebody else had control over it and you're not aware, then it's not gonna be as bad. But obviously, I'm a chicken. Um, it says about 12 week treatment. So literally, I've got to do it once every, once a week for 12 weeks, and then you do top ups. Um, also, hopefully I'll be able to go up to the super speedy and super strong speed. No, super strong flashes at some point. 
but as it stands it's not painful per se it's a bit of a shock um, it's it's not like an elastic band like people say it is warm and then in some places like your knees and things like that yeah I'll admit that's um, interesting to say the least it's uncomfortable I don't know if it's because like they're quite knobbly or something or there's lots of nerves going on in there but it hurts when it gets to there and little jointy bits and you know just before you get to your lady garden that's um that's not fun and fair play to anybody that can tolerate that but personally i don't want to put anything that could potentially burn my privates done pretty well i think i've been quite brave i think i deserve an oreo <laughs> So hopefully you guys enjoyed this and hopefully you did and please hit like and subscribe and hit the bell notification for all my future videos or content, whatever you like to say. And um, have a great day. Much love beautiful peeps. Mwah.